placing the stones or hanging out here. Uh, there's got to be a story here somewhere. Photos, autographs, wine labels. What's what's going on? Well, it started uh, a number of years ago when I first jumped into this business. Um, we were invited down to. Um, to watch a Stones concert. About 14 months later, the Stones came back, and lo and behold, my brothers rented the box again, and his wife, and down we go. And just as we're getting there, my brother advised us that uh, Stones wanted the box back for some VIPs, but we got up front row center seats instead, and got invited kind of backstage for dinner. Well, when we sat down, there was uh, a bottle of red Rolling Stones wine sitting at our table. Oh, why didn't I think of this? <laughs> so I went home and I tossed and turned and I tossed and turned and it just really bothered me. I thought somebody beat me to the punch. And so I woke up one night in a sweat and came up with this idea. I said, well, why don't we do a good brand extension to what they're doing in the wine? and uh, offer what Canada does very well, and that's, of course, our Okanagan Valley ice cream. And calling London, and calling Los Angeles, and New York, and all these places where I think I can get hold of them, and nobody can give me any direction. And finally, one day, somebody comes back to me and says, oh, you need to speak with Marty. I uh, make an appointment, I go down, and I, in Los Angeles, Wilshire Boulevard, top floor of a fancy office building. Took some ice wine in tow and some composite drawings that I thought the label should look like. Get off the top floor of this fancy building and elevator and open up these big doors and there's gold records, platinum records, big pictures hanging off the ceilings of this place. Just so happens he happens to be friends with Mick Jagger and Michael Cole and the rest is basically history. I've <laughs> met with them, they liked what we were doing, so we produced the Rolling Stones Pinot Noir ice wine called Sympathy for the Devil. And just behind that, we released a Riesling ice wine, and they were so happy with what we were doing, they turned over the red wine to us as well. And we produced uh, Satisfaction out of Napa, California, and with help with our good friends, uh, Jim Ragushi and my brother James Harder. So, ta-da, here we are. So yeah, it's been a good journey. It's been a lot of fun.